With Cubase 12 and the new audio to chords function, Cubase can now detect the chords of any song using simple drag and drop. If you've ever wanted to know what chords are being used in a track that you like, or if you wanted to figure out the chords for a song you're about to remix, then you're going to really enjoy this. Let me show you. Using the audio to chords function is super simple. Basically, all you need to do is have the song that you want inside Cubase, and then you also need to create a chord track. Now I have two tracks here, completely different genres, so let me show you how this works. Let's take this track first, and what I'm gonna do is I'm going to drag and drop it into the chord track. And now Cubase analyzes the chords. And there we go, now we have the chords analyzed and we can see them in the chord track. So let's have a listen. So as you can see, all the chords are there, that's all you need to do. Now, if for some reason a chord was not perfectly detected, you can also go to any one of these chords, for example, let's go here, and you can double click on it, and then with a the chord assistant, now we have some alternatives. So this is what Cubase thinks could be alternative chords for this specific point. And what I like to do is select an instrument, for example, here I have a piano, and I can double click on this chord, and select the different alternatives. And it goes without saying that if I want, I can go back to my editor and I can just edit the chord manually. But most of the times you will find that the foundation is already there. Let's try a completely different track now. I'm going to try this orchestral track. I'm going to drag it and drop it to my chord track and Cubase will analyze it. And now Cubase has detected the chords for us. Let's have a listen. Let's check out this part where there are some complex chord progressions. So as you can see, it doesn't matter if we have modulations, if we have chords that don't belong to the key, the audio to chords function will give you a full overview of the harmonic structure of your song. Have fun with it, and I'll see you on the next one.